Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to discuss about sort bubble recursive algorithm. So as we all know, we have already talked about what is sorting algorithm, then we have in sorting, we have bubble algorithm in that you, ha you have iterative algorithm and then you have recursive type. So this is sorting bubble um, recursive algorithm, yeah? So let us go and have a look at it. What we are gonna do here is we are going to, we will write a function and we are going to use uh, enumerate for this, okay? Uh, let me, okay. Mm, okay, so let me go ahead and define my list here. My list is, let's say 64, 34, 25, 12, 22, 11, 90. Then what is enumeration? Just uh, uh, have a look at it and enumerate my list and then I say print a comma b. So what happens here? As you can see it just adds an index that is enumeration. So enumeration adds index to your given list. So we're going to use that and uh, we're going to do uh, we're going to call the function. Uh, we're going to create a function it calls itself and through recursion, it's going to solve our problem. Or it is going to sort a given array. So define right, and we are we want to make sure the given um, input is of type list, right? So we're going to assert it. Assert type array right is list and input is not a list if it is not a list then it's going to throw an error for a b in enumerate array yeah we're going to try right we're going to try accept method here accept hmm index error okay right then we're gonna say pass and return array the new array so try if array of a right uh, greater than array a plus one so in an array if an element which is to the left if it is greater than uh, the element which is to the right then we're gonna swap that right how are we going to do that? Just like how we did in the um, iterative method. So this becomes this and this becomes this. So here we are indexing the first or uh, in the first iteration zeroth item and checks uh, compares that with the first item that is zero plus one right and if the zeroth item or the item at the position a is greater than the item which is at the position b it's going to swap them here right and then we're going to repeat that till uh, come everything is sorted out right sort bubble recurse array so uh, we are adding except index error here because uh, recursion is right and it continuously keeps on doing it but since we uh, indexing is something you know it ends uh, let's say in this case six after six there is no seventh item so it's going to throw an index error so at that automatically it will catch that exception and it it'll, it will end the function otherwise if you don't use try except it will like, you know, it will uh, enter into an endless loop. Uh, and we don't want that, right? So this is our function. 
my list six for okay let me copy this here we already have it here on top but it's easy to look at it here i'm gonna say sort bubble recurse my list yeah what happened so this is the input what i gave and this is what i got what if i want to print them every time can i do that so let me do that here print ray right um, yeah so every time it finds something and it will go ahead and print the ray and i must say print swapping okay the swapping um, this and this I'm gonna put thing here okay All right, okay, uh, let me run it again. <clears throat> All right, as you can see, it says swapping 64 and 34 because 64 is greater than 34, so it swaps, and here we have the new array, and then it proceeds 64 and 25, but 64 is bigger than 25, it swaps, and we have the new, uh, new one. In that, it finds that 34 and 20, I'm sorry, 34 and 25, are not in order so it's again swaps them and here we have the new one right so it keeps on doing the 64 and 12 yeah so it will swap them swapping 64 and 12 and it swapped right so because 64 and 12 were not in order and 34 and 12 right so 34 and 12 these two they were not in order so it swaps them again so it keeps on doing it and at the end, we have the final result. Yep. So that's all we have. Thank you for tuning in. You have a great one. Take care.